Hello and welcome to this Inkscape video. In this video I'll be showing you how you can quickly create this uh, ring of rainbow colours. I'll scroll down and start from scratch. First of all, let's uh, draw a rectangle. Click the rectangle tool and just draw a thin rectangle. Shift click this cross to take off the border. And with the fill down here, I'll click on that or right click on it and make this an unset fill. It'll look black but uh, there's an important step. Select tool. Now I want to create a tiled clone but first I want it to rotate around a uh, circle. So I'll click on it a second time and drag its centre of rotation. I'll control click, drag it out somewhere like that. Okay, with this selected, now I go edit, clone, create tiled clones and there are a number of settings here that we need to adjust, not all of them. We'll leave symmetry at P1. Shift. We'll change X if you haven't got negative 100 in here, put negative 100, you've probably got zero. I think it's just remembering my last setting. So negative 100 in here, just for the Shift X. Rotation. Naught in the row, but one degree in the column, and 360 down here. These two numbers have to multiply to 360 degrees. Under colour, an important step is to have the initial colour as uh, set at you know blue or red or something like that. You may not have that, but if you click on that and select the colour wheel and drag the circle and the line there to whatever colour that you want to set it at, and um, then close out of that. Make sure you've got a colour in there not the black that I already had because you can't bl change black in hue it's got to be starting with a colour you can see I'm shifting the colour by 0.277 of a percent I got that by doing 100 divided by 360 so with all those settings in place click create and there you have it I'll just control and mouse wheel a ring of colour now that rectangle has to be fairly thin, if you make it too thick, things overlap too much, it looks a bit clunky. But uh, with a rectangle about the size that I had there, you should be right. So there's an interesting little effect using tiled clones and rainbow colours in Inkscape. Thanks for watching.